Hello and welcome to the video. In this video, we solve exercise problem 3-3. In this exercise, we actually increase the simulation time from 20 minutes to 8 hours, but we made only single replication and rest of the values remain same as we did in previous exercises. Okay, let's jump to the arena screen. So here you can see the parts arrive to the system, drilling center and parts leave the system. Under part arrive to system, uh, they are randomly distributed with a mean time of 5 minutes. Entries per arrival is equal to 1 and simply click OK. Under drilling center, you can see each values are remain same as we did in the previous exercise. And then finally parts leave the system. This is the resource animation. Okay, so the timeline of the chart is actually changed from 20 minutes to 480 minutes. So how you can change this thing? Simply double click the chart, move to the axis tab under the time axis. Here you can find the scale label. Under the scale label, change its maximum value to 480 with increment of 60 and you have to repeat the same step for the other chart that is number pz move to the axis and then under the scale label change its value from 20 to 480 minutes and major increment of 60 units and then simply click ok ok now move to the run setup or replication parameter change its value from 5 to 1 as stated in exercise 3-3 and the replication length is now 8 hours instead of 20 minutes and hours per day is equal to 24 and then simply click OK and now let's run the simulation OK let's fast forward it and then click the yes button to view the report and under the category overview report you can found that 90 parts enter the system and 89 parts left the system while one part is in the drilling station at the termination stage okay so the total time in system is 6.8 sets average time for total time of the system is 6.8 sets and maximum value or the maximum time for entity remain stay in the system is 18.73 so this is the maximum value this is the minimum value and this one is the average value that entity single entry can stay at the system okay so wait time in the queue is three point okay so first move to the queue spreadsheet and here you can see the waiting time for drilling center queue is 3.33 sets one on average and its maximum value is 15.5870 and the Q length is given here that is here is Q length okay this is the Q length 0.6255 and maximum Q length is 4 and move to the resource and the utilization of the drill press is 65.18%. So this concludes the solution. Thank you.